SCP-095, aka The Atomic Adventures of Ronnie Reagan. Object Class, Safe. Special Containment Procedures. SCP-095 is to be placed in a standard polyethylene lane sleeve when, when not under scheduled release. There's an stored in a uh, standard lock, lock filling, filing cabinet and to prevent damage or wear. High resolution digital scans is are available for any level 1 when and above personnel who wish to view SCP-095. Description SCP-095 appears to be a set of three, three modernly aged black and white comic books was printed in 1932. The front and rear cover is our myth. Seeing in several pages has been rendered illegible due to water damage. It was found by by agent redacted in a small small antique shop in Denver, Colorado, and purchased for a small fee without incident. The owner of the shop shop had apparently he not read read the item them the pet past the publisher's da date on the first page. Forensic inspections of SCP-095 have revealed to be genuine, though completely unremarkable, will save for its content. It is printed on cheap pulp, pulp paper and inked with dyes common into other publications publications of its era. The publisher's stamp indicates it was produced by Future Funnies, a company operating out of the out of town on a purple lake Ohio. All research and inquiries thus far far have shown both the company and and the town to be be completely non existent. The comic itself Itself is a pulp science fiction story entitled The Atomic Adventures of Ronnie Reagan, featuring the, a lead character bearing an unmistakable resemblance to former U.S. as President Ronald Reagan. Each story opens with a large panel reading In the far fetched, fetched future world of the of the 1980s, only Ronnie Reagan can save the day. It appears to follow an episodic format with one, one self-contained in story per, per publication. The three stories are briefly described below. Ronnie vs. Space Admiral Carter This story pits his planetary, planetary governor Ronnie Reagan and his sidekick Space Major Herbert were against the, the titular Space Admiral Carter as they both vie for, for the position of Space Marshal. The events loosely follow the events of the 1980 presidential election. Space Assassin This story follows a character named Space Man Hick Hinkley as he prepares to assassinate in space, space Marshal Reagan. He manages to catch Reagan by surprise and wound him on with his devastator ray before we're being subdued by by Reagan's soldiers. The event friends obviously referred to the the 1981 assassination attempt by John Hinckley Jr. Jungle Planet. This story follows Reagan's attem attempts to create in an army of robots on on the jungle cover or planet of Nick uh, in order to protect them from the evil full sand bandits. Although Reagan is told that he will lose his command when if he interferes with events of on planet Nika, he sends his lieutenant colonel. Space Colonel West to securely build, build a force under the cover from the jungle. When their plan, plan is discovered, Space Colonel West 
publicly takes the blame and saves his superior. In Stormlight, it appears to be a simplified retelling of the art Iran Con Contra 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 of 1986. Possibly the most interesting is the final page of these of each book, which advertises is the the other stories published by future funnies. Investigation is underway to locate any, any surviving companies at once. The advertised stories are are listed below. Space Major Herbert assumes command. Starman really versus is the space succubus. Globe Walker her in sneak attack. Fairy Beetle Oju who's on planet Afgar. Diamond Donnie in putting on, putting on the Ritz. Sky Mar Marm Sarah uh, of the Ice World. Flying Franken in versus Rock. Get Rush. Star Command. Man Proton in a loose in battle. The New Menace. Death to, to Mankind. Personal Log of Dr. Redacted. October 6, 2000. Isn't 2004. I don't really. I don't think I need to empathize how important it is to recover any of all, all of the advertised stories immediately. The, the final two in particular. 